So today I'm gonna be doing another 555 video and I, I kinda got curious and so today we're gonna see how far a 555 mortar monkey can get. And if you didn't know the mortar monkey is kind of like really good on its own. Like the <clears throat> I don't know if they nerfed it or not, but the second the second tier not second tier. The second path is amazing. The pop and ah, uh, it was really great for some time. Which, like I said, I don't know if they nerfed it or anything, so I don't know if it's still good now. But what I was thinking was, this shoots insanely fast, obviously. And then, we could also get the biggest one. So, it's gonna be like, the biggest one times a hundred. As well as Bloom Cineration. So, we're gonna have a very, very powerful tower. Possibly one of the most powerful yet. So, I'll go ahead and start upgrading it. I'll do 2-2-2 two, two, two to start it off. Let's just see if this is strong or not. I mean, not surprising that it does well here. Okay, when it starts to struggle, I'll put it up to tier 3. I just want to gradually let it level up, as I don't do this for the other video, so I figured it'd be interesting. Alright, I'm sure it's going to do fine for a while. Okay, I am noticing that the yellows kind of don't... They kind of burned for a little bit instead of getting popped instantly, so I'm going to do it to tier 3 now. Which is completely unnecessary, but this is fun to watch. Alright. Very powerful, as I expected. I'll just do tier 4 now, I'm kind of excited. Oh god. Yeah, this is what I mean with the fast attack speed. Let's look at this on that. Yeah, so it's shooting very fast even like this. Okay. I'll put it to tier 5 now. Biggest one. Oh god. The animation can't even keep up with how fast it's shooting, which is kind of funny. Pop and naw. Oh my god. Then the blue incineration. Oh boy. Alright. This is definitely going to make it pretty far, because it fills up this whole circle perfectly. This is a ton of rapid fire biggest one in blue incineration, which is awesome. I wonder what the ability does, I wonder if it's different. No? Okay, it's still popping off. Alright, I'll just speed it up until things get kind of rough, I guess. Okay, we're almost to the Moab, so I'm sure it's just going to get destroyed. Yep, alright. I'm sure it'll be the same case with the BFB, but we'll see. Okay, the BFE is about to arrive. And... There you go. Alright, it's gone.
Okay, so now we've made it to the bat again. Well, not again, but for this video. And, yeah, it's definitely gonna be gone. And I actually set up an auto-clicker. Not an auto-clicker, but like, a thing that just hits one over and over again. Not like rapid fire, but like it does it every 10 seconds, which I think is like halfway of the bar. So it just constantly, instantly hits my pop and on ability, which is really helpful so I can like AFK this kinda. Because usually in these videos I don't sit here for the whole thing. Just because that's kind of inconvenient for me when I have like school and stuff to worry about. But now I have this and this should be helpful for this and I'm just going to see how far this can make it. I'd say that it would probably make it to, considering the damage scaling, or the health scaling of the Moabs, I would say that it can make it to like 120 or 115 maybe. Which I might be completely wrong and it makes it way farther than that. But let's see. I guess I'm wrong about my prediction, and could probably make it, it might make it to round 125. But I can tell it's starting to struggle, like I said, from the damage scaling, or health scaling, or whatever it's called. Which if you don't know what I'm talking about, when you get into further rounds, the Moab and Bloon HP, like for the Fortified and Ceramics, all of those health stats go up like really, really high. And they also get much faster, especially like bads and DDTs, they start to go extremely fast. So, you can kind of see it now, it's starting to get a little bit more tough for things to, or, or it's getting more tough for the Mortar Monkey to break things. Or like Shattered, Fortified and stuff, which is weird because I have the thing that gets rid of Fortified. But I guess it only applies for the little circle in the middle. Yeah, it looks like it. Alright, that makes sense. But, I'd say my new prediction might be like 140 to 150. Looks like 140 might actually be the end for this. Oh, yep. Alright. I don't think abilities would save that. Okay. It had a decent run. I was pretty much correct on how far I thought it would go. But I'm not surprised that a fortified bad was what ended that because it was really just pure health that would defeat that. Because anything that's not a bad would get destroyed immediately since, um, you know, it has the stun thing to where it'll stun anything that's not a bad. So, yeah, that was a pretty good run, and I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any requests for videos, please leave them in the comment section, and I hope you have a great day. Bye.